signed his contract cease at the end of the season, so they'll have something to play for. And just, and, and, and I guess an ability to play without pressure is always an advantage. And I do expect Barnett to play without pressure for the, re for the rest of the season. And actually, let's not forget, John, they have been a football league club for the majority of the last 15 years or so. County on the front foot with Reed squaring the ball now into midfield for Newby. Newby playing the, the John Rooney role tonight. Here's Crowsdale, Minihan. Tried to feed it back into the middle. It comes to Alex Reed. Gets it onto his left foot. He'll shoot from here. Never quite got himself set. But it's a, a good early start for County and a good early shot from Alex Reed. Yeah, it seems a long time ago, John, the, 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 the last County Barnet commentary that we did together mm. just over a year ago. Uh, and now Barnet will bring it away. Down that right hand side. That's a good run into the box. This is a chance for Barnet early on, but the snapshot off target in the end. But County rather caught out there by the sucker punch of the counter-attack. So, John, I think we've been playing just less than three minutes and there's already been three, three certainly half chances. That's probably the best of the lot. Maynard joining the attack and he's found Newby on the right. He's onside, crosses towards Cardwell, off the post. Agonising for Harry Cardwell, so close to the opening goal. But it stays nil-nil. Great ball in. Um, made a very encouraging start to the game. You'd be great ball in. A lovely flick header. Crowsdale, Reed. Good sharp passing from County on the edge of the Barnet box. They might have an opening here for Newby to strike. Left-footed. Good save by Azaz. Scrambling across to his left-hand side. It may have been going wide anyway, but he couldn't take the yeah. chance. Short corner routine. Walker. That's a brilliant There's the header. Ball. What a save by the goalkeeper, but then it's bundled in at the far post. Hogan's claiming that one. Liam Hogan, his initial header was kept out, but he was able to follow in that effort. And it's the skipper who gives County the lead. It's a goal that's been coming. Stockport County 1, Barnet nil. What a ball. What a ball into the box. He, I think he knocks a crossing just before that, John, which they nearly scored from. That's a, fa a fabulous ball into the box. Barnet on the front foot here. It's uh, Mason Clark to shoot from distance. That was a stinging effort. Ben Hinchliffe diving to his right. He did well to hold on to it. Great strike. Really good strike. Nice footwork. Great strike. Great strike. And Ben, I think Ben would have expected to save it, but a, a, a great strike. And some nice approach play from Barnet again. Here's Newby. Crowsdale. Oh, it's sloppy from Crowsdale. He played it blind. He's been, he's given it away to Petrasso. And now Farl on the edge of the box, just trying to get it out from under his feet. It might come back to Petrasso, and indeed it did. I'm not sure how much Petrasso knew about the shot. Loose balls collected by Taylor. Taylor trying to play out from the back. Oh, and it was a risky ball to McQueen. Immediately dispossessed, but Newby shoots wide. That was a good chance then for Stockport County. And it was a nervy clearance, wasn't it, by the, by the bees? <laughs> Interesting, Joey. You can hear every word coming <laughs> no. out on the pitch. And I think one thing, if you do shout and scream, you do get a decision uh, whilst there are no fans because it's so audible when John, you, uh, you shout that uh, you've every, been hurt. Everybody criticises players for shouting the referee. and, and, and But it, I'll tell you, I, I absolutely do think it makes a difference. I, I do think that makes a difference. I do think, uh, unfortunately, that, that does influence decisions that are made sometimes. Reed's volley from the edge of the box is blocked by the centre-half daily. Hogan returning the ball to Ben Hinchliffe. Hinchcliffe forced to go long this time. Cardwell's beaten in the air by the uh, powerful centre-half, Richards Everton. Now Taylor to bring it clear. <coughs> good feet from Petrasso. He's a good player, he's Petrasso. Well what a ball that is as well. <laughs> he's done oh. very well in John. I guess the, I think he's been Barnett's most influential player in the uh, probably the opening 25, uh, 25 minutes of this game. Minihan. Twisting and turning to create the space for Crowsdale. Here's Alex Reed. There was another pass on there, and Tom Walker's frustrated on the far side, but Reed felt he could go for goal. It's Barnett on the front foot again. They've responded well to the early setback and the deep Great cross ball. is dangerous towards the far post and it's headed over the bar in the end by uh, the front man, Baker Richardson. But he got above Minihan quite comfortably there. Yeah. 
three in the wall. And then just behind the wall, Alex Reed has taken up an interesting position. Taylor's concerned and has gone to, to mark him. Walker has gone for goal. It's a forgettable effort, though. Always rising. And it stays 1-0 to Stockport County. Leaves it for Minihan again. Chance to cross from the right. Four in the box. Minihan drills it in hard and low. Madden with the shot blocked inside the six-yard box. The referee spots an infringement and the whistle goes, but Paddy Madden, well, didn't have to wait long for his first chance, first sight of goal. Yep. Here's Newby shooting from distance, hits the back of the defender, Richards Everton, comes back to Newby. Newby on the edge of the box, great feet from Newby, threads it through to Reed. gets the return ball. The uh, angle was against him for the shot and the move breaks down. The mass ranks of amber shirts getting the ball away, but... It's a rather panicky clearance in the end, straight to Keane. And now Minihan on the right wing, two in the box. One of them's Paddy Madden. The ball, though, found Reed. Oh, good, good effort from Alex Reed. Snapshot on the right foot. A very good save again from Azaz. Corner to County. That's a good attempt from just inside the penalty area and a very good block by Liam Hogan to bring this first half to its conclusion. Stockport County have been pretty good tonight, you have to say that, but Barnet have been gritty and determined in their responses, but it was a quick fire start. Barnet on the ball, it's foul again. Dispossessed by Walker, but County very careless in possession in the early stages of this second half. And it's the Bees pushing forward, there's a trip there, and the referee, oh, he's given a free kick. That would be interesting. We can't really see it from here, John, but that must have been right on the edge of the right on the edge of the box. We couldn't really see it was inside or not. Player here. I mean it's virtually on the line. <laughs> it's as near to the line as it can be without being a penalty. Yeah, I'll certainly be watching that one back later yeah. because <laughs> But but not many protests either, John, no. for the Barnet players. He seems to accept it, get on with the game. The referee had a good view of the initial contact. He's gonna move this county wall back some distance, yeah. by the way. Indeed, he sprayed the line now. It's a, a big moment in the game. Good save by Hinchliffe. Dive into his left-hand side to keep out the free kick. The follow-up shot is a, a miscue. Well, Ben Hinchliffe, more clean sheets than any other goalkeeper in the National League this season. Barnett will be encouraged by their start to yeah, this very second start. half. Certainly on the front foot. The corner initially clear, but it's going to come straight back in again. It's loose on the edge of the six-yard box, and Paddy Madden <laughs> happy to put it out for a throw-in. Here's Madden now. Lofts the ball forward for Newby to chase. The goalkeeper's committed, but again, timed his yeah. run perfectly. Good anticipation, good handling. It's really important that when the opposition having spells of uh, possession like this, and you keep your concentration on the, at the back. So far, the county back four have done really well in that. Mm. The county back three, the three centre halves, and the two were. Uh, the two fullbacks have done really well so far in keeping them at bay. Petrasso trying his luck. It was good work initially by Mason Clark to tee him up, and Petrasso there coming in off that left hand side found himself in that pocket of space between the lines. It opened up for him nicely. Hogan just standing off slightly and inviting the shot, but it was always rising from Michael Petrasso. County force back to Jordan Keane. Keane does well, good feet, halfway line. Barnett trying to hold their shape to keep the Hatters at bay. Jennings, very isolated, foul forcing him wide. And snapping at his heels, trying to take the ball away from JJ. Jennings thought he was impeded, referee doesn't agree. County have the ball anyway. Newby on the half turn there, inside Barnett territory, darting forward. Walker takes over, left side. Jennings goes on the overlap, uses him as, as a decoy that time though. Here's Reed, Newby. Here's a chance for Madden. Oh my word! He's headed it down, but headed it into the ground and over the bar. Well, <laughs> what a waste of money! <laughs> uh, just forget. I mean, brilliant move by County. Really great move. Some lovely approach play. Here's Newby again. This is a great run. 
and he's found Sam Minihan. Oh, what a block on the line from Daly. Fantastic defending. It comes out, though, to the edge of the area for Crowsdale, whose shot's deflected behind for a county corner. What a block from Daly. Fabulous stinging effort from Minihan. Great play all round. Great play. Credit to Sam for getting forward. Lovely strike. Great defending. Well, if uh, Paddy Madden can't believe his miss, I don't think Sam Minion can quite believe that goal line clearance from Daly. Two golden opportunities for County on the hour mark, but it stays 1-0. Here's Daly again. Delivers the ball towards the inside left channel. This is the chance for Barnett, and they have equalised McQueen, the goal scorer. Great ball from Liam Daly, the provider, and County made to pay for those missed opportunities as McQueen buries the chance. It's his first goal of the season, and Barnett have got themselves back into the game at one all. Yeah, you spoke about great defending um, from Sam Minnan's shot the other end. I'm not sure that's great defending. Um, at the other end of the pitch. I think I think Jordan Keane gets underneath the ball, misses his header, a brilliant touch by the Barnet forward, good finish, but I think Jordan will be really disappointed there that he's not managed to uh, get his head on that ball. The ball from Madden through the gap for Jennings. Jennings, though, runs into traffic. But uh, here's a chance maybe for Keane to make amends. That's a great ball. And it's a chance for County, the header from Madden on target but a good save oh it's good play by Mason Clark down the right wing and he's found Petrasso there's only one in the box to pick out and he almost found him well played Sam Minahan yeah Minahan puts it to, I thought he'd gone for a corner but Petrasso's kept it in dinks it into the box this time headed away on the far post by Crowsdale Barnet haven't finished yet. They come again down that left-hand side. And they've got a throw in. Hogan, oh, a heavy touch from Liam Hogan. It's a horrible mistake, and it could allow McQueen in for his second, and Barnet's second as well. In the end, Hinchliffe sprints off his line. They're appealing for a penalty, but more in hope than expectation. Liam Hogan massively relieved against him for the cross. He gives it back out to Walker on the left-hand side. Now the chance is on for Jennings to play it into the box. It's too close to the goalkeeper, but it might chance. come to Crowsdale. Wide of the target, so unlucky. Aziz cleared his lines. It fell kindly for Crowsdale. He's got to hit the target. County players still adjusting as well to the new formation. As the cross comes That's into the county penalty area, there's a push there yeah, on I Sam Minion. The referee John. didn't it see did, it. It did definitely look like a foul. It's a blatant shove on uh, Sam Minihan. Petrasso at the moment, he's dropping so deep. It's almost a back five now for Barnet. And they've still got uh, Taylor sitting in front of them. So uh, it really is uh, rear guard action from Barnet. But uh, when they do push forward, they, they have threatened in this second half to score more than that. Equalising goal. But here come County again with Sam Minihan leading the charge. Inside the penalty area, Stretton. It's and he's gone across him into the back of the net. Stretton off the bench and into the goals. You've know, you got to give Sam Minahan bags of credit there. Real drama and determination from Sam Minahan to actually do as well as he did. Well, Alex Reed trying to claim it on the line, but I think Stretton may well have got the final touch there. Alex Reed was making absolutely sure it went in. Alex Reed, like all good strikers, trying to uh, follow it in and claim a tap in but uh, Jack Stretton has been credited with the goal Barnet meanwhile have been credited with uh, their second corner of the night and they're throwing bodies forward now they've taken a short one County have switched off McQueen's cross Hogan with a very very good defensive header well that's when you need your captain and again being occupied by McQueen I well played Ryan Crowsdale. Well, what a relief from a Stockport County perspective to hear that final whistle. It's a massive three points for Stockport County. It's another win 
for the Hatters, but they have conceded a goal, the first goal they've conceded in five games here at Edgeley Park. Away to our left, Eamon Azaz slumped yeah. inside his penalty area. He looks absolutely distraught about that, uh, that game, and I can understand why, because it's been a terrific performance by uh, Barnett tonight, who've put up very, very strong opposition, but it's Stockport County who claim all three 